This husky was sick and covered in mange, but the photos of his transformation are heartwarming. This stray husky was sick and mangy, but a couple took the dog in, rehabilitated him, and named him Wolfgar. They even documented his recovery, and their photos are testament to what love and care can do for a creature in need. Before we begin, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the notification bell for more amazing videos. On March 2, 2016, an Imgur user who goes by the name Strategically Placed Bananas shared a heartwarming rescue story. Indeed, the pictures are proof of the power of a little TLC. The tale all started when the user's husband saw a post on Facebook. The post caught her husband's eye and for good reason. His friend had posted about a stray husky on the streets and how she'd kindly taken the animal in. The homeless hound didn't have any identification, microchip, or a dog tag on him, though. It seems that the lady had only welcomed the dog in on a temporary basis, however. As a result, she was now looking for a forever home for the pooch. The Imgur user's husband was keen straight away as he had grown up with dogs and in particular huskies. So maybe the stars were aligning for them to meet. Then on November 8, 2015, the husky came to live with the couple. When they arrived to pick the dog up, he instantly approached the woman but gave her spouse a wide berth. Indeed, he seemed unsure about men in general and didn't allow any males to even touch him. Sadly though, Wolfgar was still not in a good way. His bones showed through his skin, his hair had come away in places, and his tail was sparse. Additionally, he'd clearly suffered a bad injury, evidenced by a big scar running over his ribcage. So that very same day, the caring couple whisked their new pooch off to the vets. When the veterinarian put the dog on the scales, the husband and wife were presumably shocked to see the readings. The rescue animal weighed in at just 39 pounds. Considering that a husky should weigh between 45 and 60 pounds, this was cause for concern. But that wasn't all that was wrong with the malnourished mutt. The vet examined him further and diagnosed the mongrel with demodectic mange, a skin infection. Although this condition isn't uncommon, it's another hardship for the poor doggy to deal with. Huskies naturally have an additional coat, so for the dog to look so mangy, the infestation must have been around for a while, probably many weeks. The vet gave him medication and special shampoo to restore his coats to their full sheen and splendor. Still, the couple probably counted their blessings when they discovered that at least Wolfgar didn't have fleas. The couple wondered where the new addition to their household had come from. Their theories ranged from abandonment to escape, but they favored the latter due to indications that the dog had been physically abused. Nonetheless, the pair were conscious of the possibility that someone was pining for him. They consequently searched records on the internet for locals who might have lost a dog, but their efforts turned up no leads. Meanwhile, they ensured that Wolfgar made new furry friends playing his standard behavior for huskies and it was certainly second nature for Wolfgar. As a result, the couple forged full steam ahead with settling their husky in. They were quick to buy him a bed so that he'd feel safe and at home. He apparently entered the kennel easily, so they assumed at some point in his past he'd lived in a similar space. For the first couple of evenings, the dog whimpered, but the couple wouldn't let him in their bedroom because of his skin disease. Around seven days later, though, he had become part of the furniture. Perhaps Wolfgar was tired from his previous ordeals as he apparently took lots of naps, and he wasn't picky about where he took them. By the start of December 2015, in fact, Wolfgar was happily riding in cars. In this picture, it's obvious that he had gained some much-needed extra weight, although he still remained skinny. Wolfgar continued to grow, and by the middle of January 2016, his neck was much thicker than the month before. He was also becoming territorial. One of his favorite habits was guarding the couple's yard and looking at the neighbors. If anyone got too near, Wolfgar would woof at them. Wolfgar is now truly an integral member of the family. Indeed, he's managed to graduate to his human's bed, and nowadays he rests at night besides his rescuers, hopefully having sweet dreams. However, as his owner wrote on Imgur, he's prone to kicking us in his sleep and hogging my husband, so possibly to the detriment of matrimonial harmony. But who can be angry with him when he looks this cute? Moreover, there are hundreds of comments on Imgur praising the couple for helping Wolfgar to get back to his best. One user wrote, that light in his eyes is back. You can definitely see a difference from now and then. Another turned their attention to the people responsible for Wolfgar's state in the first place. People who do this to animals should have it done to them, the comment read. Seriously, animal abusers are one of the worst breed of scum in existence. Nonetheless, Wolfgar is now so comfortable with his owners that he tries to sneak into the kitchen for people food, despite not being allowed. 
he has visibly thrived in his new surroundings and his current appearance is a far cry from when the couple originally met him so although it was a long road for Wolfgar he managed to enjoy a happy ending eventually according to his new owner he's become a healthy spoiled dog and we love him and all the fur he leaves on our clothes thanks to the magic of social media then he's found his family where he has evidently flourished